Intro to the Problem, Climate Change by Kate. What is the issue? The average temperature of Earth's atmosphere is rising. Earth's temperature has risen by 0.14 Fahrenheit per decade since 1880, but the rate of warming since 1981 is more than twice that. This happens as the amount of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere increase, they trap more of the sun's heat in the atmosphere and raise the temperature of the Earth overall. The human contribution to this problem is when humans burn fossil fuels, remove trees from the planet, um, and basically contribute more carbon dioxide or other greenhouse gases to the atmosphere. Why is this important? Rising temperatures? As the Earth heats up, areas like the polar ice caps start to melt. This destroys the habitat of animals that live there and causes the ecosystem collapse. The last nine years have been among the top 10 warmest years ever recorded. It also contributes to more extreme weather events. Typhoons, hurricanes, storms, and droughts have become more common as global warming has increased. These storms are devastating to many populations who have their land and livelihood destroyed. Biodiversity loss. As temperatures rise, the amount of oxygen in the ocean decreases, killing off phytoplankton, which is essential for the whole marine food chain to survive as they are one of the first steps in the food chain. Coral is also killed in this process. How is this problem related to chemistry? First of all, chemistry is essential in solving a wide variety of problems. Greenhouse gases consist of a variety of chemical compounds, specifically carbon dioxide, CO2, methane, CH4, or nitrous oxide, N2O. All of these compounds are covalently bonded. If we can understand these chemical compounds better, we can figure out ways to potentially remove them from the atmosphere. Some solutions that solve climate change also involve chemical reactions. One possible solution is releasing sulfur dioxide and having it oxidize in the atmosphere. This forms particles that can reflect sunlight back into space and potentially mitigate the effects of greenhouse gases. Thank you.